Hey y'all, welcome to B's Intuition. I'm B and I'm back with another general collective energy message. Thank you guys for tuning in. I really appreciate it. I do cuss and I do tell the truth. So if you don't like either one of the two, then you probably should move on. I've already prayed over the cards and the energy, so we're just going to hop in and get this message. Please remember to like, share, and most importantly, subscribe, especially to those of you that are viewing the channel but have not yet subscribed. You don't want to miss out on the messages that God has for you. Also, please remember to take what resonates only and leave the rest for whoever it's for. Every message will not be your message. So, with that being said, y'all, let's hop in. So, there are people that are going to be trying to confirm somebody. So, you know, like somebody, you know, could be, you know, um, exceeding expectations, you know, at work. And I'm just using uh, this as an example. Um, there's people, you know, that definitely could have, you know, not ever confirmed, you know, that somebody does a good job at work or, you know what I mean? There definitely could be people that, yeah, could have never acknowledged somebody in general that are going to try to, yeah, confirm somebody, you know what I mean? These could be people, you know, somebody's been a parent for, you know, 20 years, you know what I mean? And now people want to confirm that somebody, you know, is a great parent, you know what I mean? Somebody has done a great job at parenting, you know? Um, you know, there could be, you know, like a estranged brother or sister that comes out of the blue and it's like, you're the best sister, you're the best brother, but you know what I mean? This is a sister or a brother, you know what I mean, that you don't communicate with, you know what I mean? Y'all don't have, you know, a relationship, you know? It's something about, yeah, people, you know, wanting to confirm somebody, you know what I mean? I feel like it's a way for people to pull on somebody's energy. Because that's really, you know what I mean, uh, what I'm what I'm feeling. Like that there are people that, you know, are trying to pull on somebody's energy. So I feel like that somebody, yeah, just needs to be aware of that. Um, but it also could be because somebody could be receiving some type of good news or receiving some type of um, update. Or that could be two separate things. Like somebody could be receiving some good news, but somebody could also be receive, receiving some type of update as well. There's also a false marriage that's getting ready to be exposed on social media. So this could be, you know, like um, a celebrity false marriage, you know, and it could be, you know, being exposed like by TMZ, you know, or, you know, some type of gossip channel, you know, um, or something like that. Or this literally could be, yeah, like somebody that lives a regular life or people that live a regular life and their false marriage is about to be exposed and, and it's going to be on social media. You know, this could be through documents. This could be, you know, through word of mouth. But there is a false marriage that's about to be exposed. I also did a message about um, some uh, some uh, events in October. Um, I think the title is something about... Um, hold on, y'all. Let me see. So, for those of you that, you know, haven't watched that uh, video, y'all can uh, go watch it. To know what I'm talking about. Hold on, y'all. Yeah, expect the unexpected. Next 30 days will be very eventful, painful information. Um, that was like three days ago. Um... So, for those of you that didn't watch that video, that's what I'm talking about. Um, so, yeah, that message that I did, um, I'm picking up on that energy again. And so, I remember in that message, I was saying that, like, um, people are, are a part of, you know, the, uh, the events that are going to take place. It has something to do with karma. Um... And I said that, yeah, the karma is going to be like mild or, you know what I mean, people, you know what I'm saying, it could be mild. And so people, you know, could be, you know, like prancing along, like nothing's going on and things of that nature. Well, I feel like uh, karma is going to start amping up uh, in some people's lives. 
And I feel like these people are still going to be prancing around like, you know, nothing's going on. Um, but by the end of December, I feel like, yeah, karma is going to be so high for people that, yeah, uh, they're not going to know what to do. You know what I mean? Mm hmm. Karma is definitely going to be at an all time high for some people by the end of December. Um, for some people, yeah, it could be by the end of October. Mm hmm. Yeah, there's also rumors that have been going around about somebody, you know, um, whatever these rumors are, they're going to lead to some type of good clout for somebody. So that could be the good news that somebody could be receiving. Um, but there is somebody or some people, yeah, that were spreading, you know, fake lies, fake news, you know, rumors, you know what I'm saying? False narratives. And, and it's going to turn out, you know what I'm saying? Uh, to be, you know, basically a blessing, you know what I mean? So there are people that, yeah, deemed, you know what I'm saying, what they were doing as, uh, you know, using it as a destructive tactic. And basically, yeah, it's going to, it's going to, yeah, manifest in a blessing for somebody. So let's just hop in and uh, see what's going on, y'all. Yeah, somebody's about to reach new heights or, or that's what somebody's already doing is reaching new heights. There is a dark uh, energy that's that's surrounding somebody or dark energy that's hovering over somebody. This could be a, a feminine energy. Whatever that dark energy is, uh, that dark spirit or whatever that's hovering over this person, it's about to overtake this person. Mm -hmm. And I feel like that they're not going to be able to fight it. Mm-mm. Wow, we have the big house, but it came out in the reverse. Mm -hmm. Somebody could live in a small house or somebody yeah, is about to move. You know what I mean? Maybe somebody could be downsizing, going from a big house to a small house. Or this is, yeah, that karma. You know what I mean? So, yeah, somebody or some people that were living in a big house. You know what I'm saying? Uh, living in condos. You know what I'm saying? Living, you know, living up, living it up. Definitely, yeah, could be having to downsize. So, yeah, they could be having to go, you know to a smaller home or even, you know what I'm saying, like an apartment or something like that. Mm -hmm. Somebody, yeah, somebody or some people definitely, yeah, could be losing, you know what I'm saying, like a job. This could be like a good job too. There definitely, yeah, could be some type of cor corporation that could be, you know, going down, organization, cult, you know. There definitely, yeah, could be some type of charity that could be being exposed as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah. This is uh, the sit and have a conversation card, but it's in the reverse. So somebody, yeah, could be scared to sit down and have some type of conversation. Or the fact of the matter is, yeah, it's kind of like, yeah, this could be, you know, somebody that, that, that was the leader of something. You know what I mean? A leader of a cult, a leader of an organization, a charity or something like that. But yeah. Uh, their 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 system is going down, and so are they. You know. Mm-hmm. Wow. Somebody could somebody could get thrown out of a building, or somebody could fall out of a window. Somebody could also be like filming a movie. You know what I mean? So that could be you know like a stunt. You know what I mean? Like somebody being pushed out of the window or falling out of the window. But I just see somebody, yeah, falling out of a window. Mm -hmm. This could be, yeah, like somebody, you know, um, in a chair. I don't know. It's also giving me two, yeah, like falling from grace, you know. Somebody definitely could have a, a dream, you know, of them falling out of a building, a window of a building as well. Mm-hmm. Whatever, yeah, whatever's going on, you know what I mean? Uh, it definitely does have something to do with, uh, you know, somebody or some people reaping what they have sown. Because this is, yeah, the sown card, you know what I mean? So, yeah, they sow and so shall they reap it. Somebody's also, yeah, reaping heartbreak. They sowed heartbreak and they're reaping heartbreak. There definitely, yeah, could be somebody because this big house is also like jail or prison. So, yeah, somebody, you know could get released from jail or prison, you know what I mean? And they don't have a pot to piss in and a window to throw it out of, you know? It's kind of like with this person being, you know, uh, 
in the reverse, it's kind of like, yeah, they didn't learn any lessons. You know what I'm saying? They didn't grow. You know what I mean? Matter of fact, yeah, they could have, you know, like, uh, you know, like they could have gotten worse. You know what I'm saying? Like they, they let the time do them. You know what I mean? They didn't do the time, you know? Mm-hmm. So that literally could be, yeah, uh, somebody that could be scared to, you know what I'm saying, sit down and have some type of conversation with somebody. It's also, too, yeah, out of embarrassment, you know? This could be, you know, out of shame, out of guilt, you know? Wow. Yeah, this is the no idea card. This is also, too, yeah, somebody not listening or trusting their intuition. It could be because, yeah, somebody's intuition is blocked. But this is also, too, yeah, like um, somebody not knowing, you know what I'm saying, something. I feel like, yeah, there is somebody or some people, yeah, that are going to think that, you know, somebody or some people don't know that they're going through karma, you know. So it goes back to, yeah, people trying to hide it, you know what I mean? But it's getting worse and worse and worse. Mm-hmm. Well, this is also, too, yeah, um, somebody not knowing what's about to take place. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, somebody or some people don't see something coming. I really feel like it's, 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 it's those that, you know what I'm saying, have been trying to hide, like, that they're not going through karma, you know what I mean? Trying to, you know what I'm saying, basically, yeah, like save face or something like that. Or that literally could be, yeah, what somebody is doing, you know what I mean? So they think that, yeah, avoiding having a conversation or avoiding communication is saving face. But it's really not. It's it's kind of like, yeah, um, deeming somebody as guilty, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Guilty of cheating, guilty of lying, guilty, you know what I mean, of, um, you know, trying to get somebody's channel struck down. Because, yeah, this is the strikeout card. So, yeah, this is also, yeah, three strikes are out. So, somebody, yeah, could be, uh, could live in a three strikes law state. Or somebody, yeah, could be, if they don't live, they're just in a three strikes, you're out, law state. Mm-hmm. So, somebody, yeah, could have struck out. Mm-hmm. Somebody definitely, yeah, could be hiding the fact that they struck out in some way, shape, form, or fashion. This is also, too, yeah, like t being taken down. Mm-hmm. So there could be, yeah, like some type of um, some type of uh, social media platform that could be being taken down or this is something. Yeah. Or there were people, yeah, behind the scenes that were trying to get somebody's social media platform taken down. Mm -hmm. But this is also too, yeah, like some type of government, some type of cult, some type of organization. Yeah. Being taken down. There definitely, yeah, could be somebody that. um don't even know that they've taken down some type of cult, some type of organization, some type of charity, you know what I mean? Some type of gang or whatever have you, you know what I'm saying? Down. Uh, yeah. This could be, you know, by, yeah, somebody's spiritual gifts because this is a spiritual gift card. Mm-hmm. Somebody definitely, yeah, could be stand offish. So it's something about, yeah... So that could be why somebody, you know what I mean, could be scared to, you know, like communicate or scared to have some type of conversation because somebody's already standoffish, you know. And maybe, yeah, somebody doesn't know why. I definitely do feel like uh, if that's the case, it's because, yeah, somebody's somebody's intuition is telling them, yeah, they, they ain't right. You know what I mean? Uh, whoever, you know what I mean? Whoever this person is. So somebody's intuition is, yeah, already you like... You know what I'm saying? Dinging. You know what I mean? The spiritual alarm is already going off, you know? Somebody definitely, yeah, is about to receive um, some uh, a new spiritual gift. This could be due to somebody losing a spiritual gift. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Pretty pink, baby blue. Why don't you teach me something new? Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Somebody, yeah, somebody's about to receive some, 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 some wisdom and knowledge. You know what I mean? It's some new wisdom and knowledge. Uh, so, yeah, going back to, yeah, the good news, the update. You know what I mean? Somebody, yeah, could receive some type of update on their spiritual gift. Mm-hmm. But it goes back to, yeah, uh, the message, you know what I'm saying, about the, um, the events taking place. Um... Yeah, this could be, you know, like an update or, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, 
It's something about an updated download or updated uh, spiritual gift or update like information. Mm hmm. Somebody, yeah, definitely could, uh, definitely could be pregnant, and they could be having a baby boy. Mm hmm. This is also too, because if y'all see, it's like multiple um, gift boxes on this uh, on this card. Yeah, something about being given a choice. There's also somebody that doesn't know how rare they are or how rare a spiritual gift is that they have. Or somebody's about to receive, yeah, a rare spiritual gift. It's also, too, yeah, rare that something takes place, you know what I mean? So it's rare that some type of um, a case like this is what I just heard gets overturned. So it's something about a case being overturned. So somebody could be being acquitted. Mm-hmm. This is also, too, yeah, like somebody not knowing, you know what I mean, you know, uh, how somebody would know something, you know what I mean? Or how somebody would know, you know, yeah, information. And it, yeah, it's, it's because, yeah, somebody's uh, spiritual gift, somebody's intuition, you know what I mean? Somebody's third eye. Yeah, somebody definitely yeah could be marrying somebody. I'm going to put it back because it just kind of slid out. Mm-hmm. But I feel like if this is a marrying, it, it definitely, yeah, could be in a bad way. Yeah, we got the case closed card. Mm -hmm. So yeah, some type of case could be being overturned and it could be being closed. This is, this, it, but it's giving me too like spiritual case as well because we do have the spiritual gift card with the case closed. Mm -hmm. Wow. This is also too, yeah. Um, yeah, somebody being given some type of, you know, spiritual gift. I feel like this is like a rare spiritual gift or it's not a spiritual gift, you know what I mean, that most people have, you know, in case closed, yeah. Somebody could be losing their spiritual gift, you know what I mean, and it could be, yeah, being given to somebody else, case closed, you know what I mean. It's kind of like, um, that's it, that's all. The sentence ends in period, you know what I mean. So whatever, yeah, is about to take place, you know, the, it, that's it, that's all. This literally could be, yeah, like the big finale, you know. Mm-hmm. Wow. There's also somebody that, yeah, could have helped, you know what I mean, uh, some type of case to be closed. This could be, yeah, somebody helping, you know, a case to be solved. This literally, yeah, could have something to do with somebody's spiritual gifts, you know. Somebody possibly doesn't know that, yeah, they're... Their uh, social media platform has been being watched. So if somebody, you know, uses their spiritual gifts on social media, yeah, somebody somebody was being watched, you know what I mean? And it definitely, yeah, helped, you know what I mean, to solve uh, some type of crime or some type of uh, case. Mm -hmm. It definitely, yeah, could have helped to multiple, you know what I'm saying, uh, multiple things, you know what I'm saying, Mo or helped multiple situations. Yeah. It's a celebration, bitches. This is the card that I uh, uh, thought was going to come out yesterday, but it didn't. So, yeah, celebration. So, I feel like, um, yeah, somebody's about to be celebrated, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, somebody definitely yeah, is being celebrated, you know what I mean? And it, it's because, you know, of, of something, you know what I mean, that they've, you know what I'm saying, helped helped to do, you know what I mean, or helped to accomplish. This could be, you know, like, um, going back to, yeah, somebody, um, you know, taking down, you know, a group, an organization, a cult, or something like that. This could be, you know, like somebody, you know, yeah, using, you know, their spiritual gifts in the way that they're supposed to, you know what I mean? And so, yeah, I feel like it, that is the case for somebody, and so, yeah, that's what you're supposed to do with your spiritual gifts, you know what I mean? So it's kind of like, yeah, somebody, somebody's about to be celebrated, but it's kind of like, yeah, somebody, um, 
whatever this celebration is, I feel like it's a big celebration. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah, somebody could go from, you know, this calm energy to, you know, like being excited, you know? But it's something about, um, yeah, colors. So somebody could be a part of the LGBTQ community, you know. I know that there's more letters that I think were added to it. I don't know. Don't, 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 don't shoot me. Mm-hmm. Wow. This is also, too, yeah, somebody finding out, you know, uh, like, you know, um, like one of their friends, you know, is pregnant. So, like, yeah, somebody could be 50 years old, you know, and, and somebody's friend could call them and be like, girl... I just found out I was pregnant, you know. This could be like a miracle for somebody. Maybe somebody thought that, you know, they couldn't have a kid, you know. Um, mm -hmm. There's also, going back to, yeah, this is a celebration, bitches, with this calm energy. It's giving me, like, you know, going back to what I was saying about people, you know, trying to confirm, you know what I mean, somebody. You're doing a great job. You're doing a great job. You know what I mean? But these people, yeah, they could come out of the blue. Or these people, you know, they could have told somebody you're doing a great job 20 years ago, you know? Um, I mean, it's better late than never. But at the end of the day, it's a reason why, you know, after 20 years, they're telling somebody, you're a great parent. You're a great parent, you know? But it goes back to, yeah, the the feelings that I was picking up, the guilt, you know what I'm saying? The, the, the sorrow, the pity, the, you know, whatever, you know? Let me not use pity, but, um, yeah. Yeah. So I feel like the yeah, somebody just you, you know needs to be aware of those people. There's also somebody that uh could receive an invitation, you know, and this could be, you know, to like a baby shower or you know what I mean? This could be, you know, to like um you know, like a birthday party. Happy birthday, Libras. So yeah, there could be, you know, a Libra that could be having a birthday party or it's something about a celebration, so somebody could get invited. You know. I definitely do feel like with that, it's a celebration, bitches, with that calm energy. You know, it definitely could be somebody, you know, that, yeah, somebody wouldn't expect to invite them, you know, somewhere. So, if that's the case for somebody, yeah, somebody just needs to, you know, be cautious, you know what I mean? This definitely, yeah, could be like a be aware message as well. Um, because I feel like that, yeah, picking up on all good things in the beginning of the message. As far as, yeah, somebody definitely, yeah, could have taken down a whole group, a whole organization, a whole family, you know what I mean? Somebody, yeah, could have defeated, you know what I'm saying, their ex-boss. They could have defeated, you know, yeah, their own car their own toxic karmic family or something like that, you know. They could have defeated, yeah, like a fake charity, you know. Um, yeah, and there are people, you know, that somebody has defeated that are going down, you know. But there's also people that, yeah, are receiving karma, you know. So, yeah, somebody definitely could be being targeted at this time, you know. They're trying to, you know, uh, basically, yeah. Put somebody's light out, you know what I mean? Stop somebody from using their intuition, you know? Stop somebody from, um, you know, being able to see, you know, in their third eye, you know? Stop somebody from using their gift of discernment. Whatever, you know, spiritual gift that somebody has, I feel like that, yeah, people definitely could be trying to stop it. But the fact of the matter is, yeah, the more that they possibly, yeah, try to stop somebody from using their spiritual gifts, the more that, yeah, either uh, somebody's spiritual gifts are upgraded or the more people lose theirs and somebody gains theirs or, yeah, somebody's about to receive some type of rare spiritual gift. You know what I mean? It's giving me like a big atomic bomb. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, somebody could be receiving like a spiritual atomic bomb as a gift, you know? But it's like a, you know what I'm saying, a unlimited atomic bomb. So, yeah, you can just keep dropping, you know what I'm saying, that atomic bomb. Or, yeah, there is a big bomb that's about to be dropped on somebody or some people, you know, of information. So, it goes back to, yeah, a false marriage, you know what I'm saying, being uh, exposed. Mm-hmm. There's also people that, yeah, we're celebrating too soon. Mm-hmm. Yep. We got the North Node card. So, yeah. Whoever you know this message is resonating with, you are operating in your North Node. And there are people that know it. You know what I mean? They know for sure, for sure, for sure. Mm-hmm. 
they definitely, yeah, could be somebody that could be getting released from, you know what I'm saying, like a jail or prison. Or this could be, you know, like somebody, you know, getting released from the hospital, you know. They could be getting out of some type of um, organization, some type of, you know what I mean, coven, cult, or whatever have you. This could be somebody that, yeah, they could just be losing everything and they could be moving. Mm-hmm. So that's that energy that I definitely did pick up on. Mm-hmm. Yep. Somebody's also being told to exit stage left. Mm-hmm. There's somebody that, yeah, they're sitting in sorrow because, yeah, they, they basically, yeah, could have ghosted somebody or told somebody to exit stage left. And now they need the same person that they basically ghosted or, you know what I'm saying, told to, uh, told to exit stage left. Mm -hmm. This is also too, yeah, like somebody definitely, yeah, could fear for their life. So somebody, yeah, could be getting out of something, an organization, a cult, you know what I'm saying? A gang, uh, you know, they could get be getting out of jail or prison, but they're scared that they're going to, you know what I'm saying, go to the upper room. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because we got the arrow right here. So yeah, Target. Mm-hmm. Somebody could work at Target. Something could happen at Target. But yeah, somebody's a Target. Mm-hmm. There is somebody that, yeah, definitely is a target because of their spiritual gifts. But there's also, yeah, somebody that, yeah, is getting out of something. Either they're getting put out of something or, yeah, they're getting released, you know. And, yeah, they're a target. Or that's how they feel. Mm-hmm. Wow. This is also, too, yeah, like karma. You know what I mean? So, yeah, like. There's somebody or some people that, yeah, they basically are realizing, you know what I mean, that, yeah, karma is real. And so it's kind of like, yeah, th there could be events that could be replaying in somebody's head, you know, like all the stuff that somebody, you know, has done, you know what I mean, bad, you know, because, yeah, I feel like somebody knows that their bad has outweighed their good, and you know, and it's kind of like, yeah, they know that eventually, you know what I'm saying, yeah, the upper room, you know what I'm saying, is, is, is going to be their new home. But I feel like, the, yeah, somebody is really, really scared, you know what I mean, about that. Somebody, yeah, some, somebody's karma definitely, yeah, could be, you know what I'm saying, that, yeah, they pass away or somebody passes away, you know? It's kind of like, yeah, the, 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 the one that was doing the targeting, you know what I mean, uh, could be, yeah, now the target. Mm-hmm. It, it, yeah, so it's, it's giving me, you know, like, um, I don't remember, you know. If it's in the Bible or if it's a movie, but when they put like that, um, that stuff on the end of an arrow, you know, I don't know if it was venom from a snake. I don't know what it was, but they put it on the end of an arrow, you know what I mean? To, sh to kill, you know what I'm saying? The person, it's kind of like, yeah, the person that they were trying to kill, it seemed like that they were, you know what I'm saying? Like unkillable. And so, yeah, they were like, yeah, this is going to take, this is going to happen. You know what I'm saying? This is going to do it or whatever. Um, and it's kind of like, yeah, because I think in the movie, it probably, I think it did, uh, I think it was a movie, it did kill the person, but it's, but I'm getting the, the part where these people put something on the end of an arrow, you know what I mean, and they shoot it at somebody, but I'm, I'm seeing that it doesn't hit, you know what I'm saying, the person that they shot it at, it basically, yeah, boomeranged, and it went back to, you know what I'm saying, that person, so it's something about, yeah, somebody, yeah, or some people are reaping what they have sown, you know, so, yeah, the target, the, the one that was targeting somebody is now being targeted. Or the people that were targeting somebody are now being targeted. Mm-hmm. This is also, too, yeah, like Cupid's arrow is also what I'm picking up. So, yeah, somebody, you know what I'm saying, could be expressing their love, you know? Mm-hmm. This could be, you know, somebody that, yeah, somebody got... Somebody that somebody got pregnant, you know what I mean? And they could be expressing their love. Or, you know what I mean? Somebody definitely, yeah, could be expressing like, yeah, I want to have a baby with you. I want to get married, you know what I mean? I want to, yeah. Mm-hmm. This is also, too, yeah, going back to, yeah, teach me something new. So, it's kind of like, yeah, uh, people s all around the world, same song. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So... 
people saying the same thing. You know what I mean? Going back to, yeah, the confirmation. But I feel like the, yeah, somebody could come across somebody that's speaking, you know what I'm saying, a different language. You know what I mean? But the same language as them, if that makes any sense, you know? Somebody, yeah, could speak multiple languages. Mm-hmm. Goes back, yeah, when I picked up on the energy the other day. I think maybe it was yesterday when I was talking about, or the day before when I was talking about somebody needs a trans, uh, it's going to need a translator. So somebody, yeah, could come in contact with somebody that, yeah, speaks the same language as them, you know? But this could be, you know, like spiritual language, you know what I mean? This could be, yeah, like somebody that, yeah, is, is, a, is a North Noter, you know what I mean? Because I feel like that, yeah, there's a lot of South Noters that are pulling on somebody's energy or a lot of South Noters, you know what I'm saying? That, yeah, they keep saying the same thing over and over and over again, you know? Mm -hmm. This could be like, yeah, somebody, you know, applying for jobs and all the jobs keep saying the same thing over and over and over again. And then, yeah, somebody doesn't see something coming as far as like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, a gift, you know what I mean? A gift, a job, you know what I mean? That, yeah, speaks the same language as them or a job that they've been wanting or waiting for, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, yeah, I feel like the, yeah, somebody definitely is going to be in this excited energy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If somebody is moving, I definitely do feel like that, Um, yeah, somebody is really, really, really excited about it. So this could be, you know, like a move, you know, for, yeah, like job or career, you know what I mean? Or this could be, you know, just like a fresh start move. For somebody, yeah, somebody possibly doesn't even know, you know what I mean, that they're about to move. So it's something about um the receiving the good news or the update, you know what I mean, that somebody, yeah, is going to receive. This is also, too, yeah, like somebody coming in contact with somebody that they don't even know. And, yeah, they hit it off. You know, this could be, you know, somebody, you know, getting a new friend, you know. This could turn into, you know, like some type of love situation. Or this could be, yeah, like somebody meeting somebody, you know. And, yeah, you know, it becomes a business partner. You know, and two people, you know, they make a very lucrative, you know what I'm saying, um, profitable business together. This could be, yeah, like two people, you know, coming together, yeah, to make a baby. Yeah, we got st stacks on stacks on stacks. So, yeah, somebody don't know about these stacks on stacks on stacks as they about to receive. You know what I mean? On top of, yeah, uh, uh, a new spiritual gift. Mm-hmm. Somebody, yeah, could be getting a surrogate or somebody, yeah, could be paying, you know what I'm saying, somebody to get pregnant or something like that. Or, yeah, that's about to be found out. But this is also, too, yeah, like somebody getting a surrogate. Mm-hmm. So there could be somebody that, yeah, they could they could be pregnant, you know what I mean? And they could be, you know, 50 years old, thought that they never could get pregnant. But there's also, yeah, somebody that uh, could be, you know, like, yeah, getting a surrogate. Mm-hmm. Maybe somebody, yeah, don't want to, you know what I'm saying, like, sh you know, put stress on their body, you know? And so that could be, you know... But why somebody would, you know, get a surrogate. But this is also, too, yeah, like paying, you know what I mean, um, somebody to get pregnant. So I feel like that, yeah, that could come out about somebody. There's also somebody, yeah, trying to pay top dollar, you know, like, so if somebody's a spiritualist, you know what I mean, or a tarot card reader, whatever have you, there's somebody that, yeah, could be trying to pay top dollar, um, for, you know, like a, a, a private message. Mm-hmm. Somebody, yeah, definitely. Whatever somebody does in their life. I really feel like that, um, yeah, going back to, yeah, people spreading rumors and lies about somebody. It's, it's leading to clout. So it's leading to, you know, some type of opportunity. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Somebody could be yeah, a teacher, a doctor, you know what I mean? But this is, yeah, pretty pink baby blue. Why don't you teach me something new? Teacher. Something about, yeah, teaching lessons. This is also, too, yeah, like somebody wanting to pay somebody to teach them how to use their spiritual gifts. But, yeah, you can't teach. You know what I mean? How to use your spiritual gifts. Mm-hmm. Yeah, with this, uh, with this apple, with the spiritual gift card, it's giving me, yeah, like, um, 
somebody somebody doesn't know that they possibly yeah have the gift of healing um they have the gift of prophecy or maybe somebody does and yeah it's it, and it's about to like be upgraded or it's about to be enhanced mm -hmm. wow there's also yeah somebody somebody definitely yeah something about a doctor or a teacher or both or somebody yeah could come in contact with a doctor or a teacher you know this is also too yeah some type of lesson so somebody's about to be about to uh be taught some type of lesson this definitely could have something to do you know what i'm saying with um yeah like the doctor you know what i mean so somebody yeah could have you know um been neglecting their health and they could find out you know what i mean some stuff about their health but going back to yeah the good news so we have excited with the apple so yeah somebody definitely yeah could be receiving some good news you know this is also too, yeah, somebody, you know, not having to go to the hospital or somebody receiving, you know, I mean, getting released from the hospital, you know? Mm hmm. Somebody definitely, yeah, does have the gift of healing out here. There definitely could be somebody that knows that somebody has the gift of healing, you know? And so, yeah, there could be somebody that, you know, uh, could possibly, yeah, come to somebody, you know what I mean, to heal them. Yep, we got the star card in the, at the top of the deck. Somebody to, yeah, definitely could be an Aquarius. Mm hmm This is also, too, yeah, like, uh, somebody, yeah, teaching somebody something new. So, it's kind of like, yeah, maybe somebody, you know, doesn't even know that they're, yeah, teaching, you know, somebody or some people some new stuff. You know what I mean? Because this is also, yeah, like the wisdom and knowledge card. This, that, yeah, somebody definitely could be learning, you know what I'm saying, about spiritual gifts through somebody else. Uh, but somebody definitely, yeah, could be an Aquarius. Mm -hmm. Somebody, yeah, could be a star, you know what I mean? Like a celebrity, or yeah. And something about, um, yeah, somebody's, somebody's light shining really, really, really bright. This is also, too, yeah, somebody helping multiple people to heal. Mm hmm. Wow. Yep. There's also somebody that wants to heal something with somebody. And yeah, case closed. So there could be, yeah, somebody that, yeah, could be, you know. Um, it's kind of like, yeah, somebody's mind is made up. But it's also multiple people. You know what I mean? So it goes back to, yeah, what I was picking up on as far as, you know, people pulling on somebody's energy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, divine intervention is at play. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Somebody, yeah, is trying to stop somebody or some people from, yeah, teaching, you know what I'm saying, new stuff. You know what I mean? Uh, somebody or some people are trying to stop, you know, somebody from, yeah, helping people to heal as well. Mm-hmm. So these could be, yeah, people that could be, you know, trying to pull on somebody's energy so that, yeah, somebody will be drained or some or so that somebody, yeah, their mind will be foggy or, you know what I mean? Yeah. So that somebody would be distracted or whatever the situation is. But I feel like that, yeah, somebody's a healer out here. Somebody, yeah, has has multiple spiritual gifts. And I feel like that somebody's spiritual gifts are really, really, really strong. But somebody's a healer out here. So, yeah, somebody can heal themselves. You know what I mean? If somebody's a healer and they can heal other people, then, of course, yeah, they can heal themselves. Mm-hmm. Wow. And then we have the takeoff card. Every time this card comes out, yeah, somebody's passed over. Because y'all know takeoff is a part of, you know what I'm saying, a, a group, a rap group. So something about that could be significant because we do have the closed case. Closed case. So there could be some type of closed case, you know, that takes place for somebody. For somebody, yeah, somebody definitely, yeah, could have, you know, helped to solve some type of celebrity case you know what i mean and somebody don't even know it or this could be yeah like multiple celebrity cases and somebody don't even know it mm -hmm. but y'all see that bullet so yeah um somebody definitely yeah something about yeah sh uh yeah a shooting mm -hmm. this is also too yeah like um Somebody, yeah, like being forewarned 
And because somebody was forewarned, yeah, something didn't take place. You know what I'm saying? It was stopped before it could take place. Mm-hmm. This is also, too, yeah, like, people thinking that somebody doesn't know some stuff and they're ten steps ahead. And so, yeah, like, it's kind of like, yeah, people are being stopped, you know what I'm saying? Every every corner that they turn, you know what I'm saying? Uh, every street that they cross, yeah, they're being stopped. Mm-hmm. Wow. But somebody, yeah, could be leaving Earth. This is also, too, yeah, like, um, whatever, you know, happened, you know what I'm saying, with, with, with that situation, you know what I mean? Um, yeah. It's kind of like people are about to receive karma. Mm -hmm. So those that think that just because they didn't get locked up, you know what I mean? Uh, they think that they're safe, but they're not. You know what I mean? Karma is justice. And so, yeah, I feel like that uh, justice is being served through karma. You know what I mean? This is from, you know, the, the highest of the highest to the lowest of the lowest, you know? But yeah, this is, uh, yeah, leaving earth. So somebody, yeah, definitely could be, be could be leaving Earth. Somebody's already left Earth. Mm-hmm. Yeah, somebody, yeah. I just, I just heard eye for an eye. So, yeah. If there is somebody that's already left Earth, whether it be, you know what I mean, in the celebrity world or, you know what I'm saying, in regular people world, you know. Yeah, it's kind of like whoever it is that passed away, yeah, they could have been, you know what I'm saying, like, um, you know. Somebody of high ranking, you know what I'm saying? Spiritually, physically, or both. And so it's kind of like, yeah. Eye for an eye. So they passed away and there is somebody else that's going to pass away. Wow, we got at the bottom of the deck. Kill Bill. So somebody's name could be Bill. But somebody, yeah. Somebody wants to get revenge. Somebody thinks that revenge is sweet. Somebody is heartbroken. Or this is this is too going back to yeah, uh, they sold it and now they're reaping it. So somebody yeah could be reaping some type of heartbreak, or somebody could be reaping you know what I'm saying um, the effects of you know a two faced lover, or somebody yeah could be finding out about a two faced lover. Mm -hmm. On the card it says for my daughter and the bride. There's a masculine energy on this card. And then we have my for my daughter and the bride. So something about, yeah, a false marriage being exposed. But it's also, too, something about for somebody's daughter. So there definitely, yeah, could be like a feminine energy. You know what I mean? That could pass away. But I was picking up on that feminine energy with that um, dark cloud hovering over them. Or that dark energy or their do that dark entity that they can't um, escape. Or they can no longer fight. Yeah, that could be, you know, the case. Mm hmm there could also be some type of um some type of back and forth going on when it comes to some type of property as well so somebody could leave some property for their daughter mm -hmm. somebody could be a Taurus but yeah the missus Wow, somebody, mm, 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 mm. yeah, so yeah, there is, could be a false marriage that could be, that could be exposed, but um, yeah, there definitely could be somebody that could pass away so that destiny can, you know, f be fulfilled, um, mm -hmm. but somebody, yeah, definitely uh, could be a household name or somebody's about to be a household name. Yep, there's the color blue was on this card. So yeah, pretty pink baby blue. Why don't you teach me something new? Mm hmm. Somebody, somebody, yeah, somebody could pass away while they're pregnant as well. Somebody could have twins and they could pass away. Or the fact of the matter is, yeah, going back to, you know, somebody finding out that they're pregnant. Yeah, they could find out that they're having twins. Mm hmm. Yeah, we got the Obamas at the bottom of the deck. So yeah. Um, emperor and Empress. So they're definitely yeah, are two people that could be coming together. Mm hmm. Soulmates. Mm hmm. Wow. Those are two powerful people. You know what I mean? It's giving me like power couple energy. So yeah, there could be two people, you know what I'm saying, coming together. You know what I mean? 
um, but it, but it's a spiritual, a, a, you know what I'm saying, a, a powerful, you know what I'm saying, spiritual connection, you know, and yeah, that could be, you know, something that somebody or some people are trying to do is keep those two people, you know what I'm saying, apart, but it's going to happen no matter what, case closed, destiny is going to be fulfilled, so yeah, if there is one or two or three or five people that got to be removed in whatever way, shape, form, or fashion that they have to be removed, you know what I mean, then so be it, you know. Because remove don't necessarily mean they uh, they pass away. You know, somebody, yeah, could just lose everything. You know what I mean? If they lose everything, then they're going to be too busy trying to figure out how to eat, how to sleep. You know what I mean? How to do whatever, you know? Mm-hmm. There is a feminine energy that, yeah, definitely could be, you know what I'm saying, like trying to avoid some type of conversation or trying to avoid somebody, you know what I mean? Or could be scared to have some type of conversation. Mm-hmm. We got American History X. So, yeah, somebody's X is history. Or is about to be. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we got game over. On this card, it says twins. The Obamas were soulmates. And then we got twins. So something about, yeah, soulmate and twin. Twin flame. But yeah, the game is over. Somebody definitely could have been violated. And yeah, somebody knows about it. There could be, yeah, like somebody, you know what I mean? That, uh, yeah. Could be scared, you know what I'm saying, to basically tell that they know that somebody was violated. Or the fact of the matter is, yeah, that's about to be, you know what I'm saying, uh, exposed as well. But somebody definitely does have some type of knowledge of, of some type of violation. But it's also, too, yeah, somebody thinks that somebody doesn't know. Mm -hmm. This could be, you know, like spiritual violation. This could be, you know, like somebody, you know... Uh, Astro traveling to somebody to do some sexual things, you know what I'm saying, uh, to somebody is what I'm picking up with this um, violated knowledge, um, but they don't know with the, um, yeah, the apple card. So somebody, yeah, could go to the doctor, but this is also too, yeah, like healing. So, yeah, spiritually or physically, you know what I'm saying, somebody was violated or both, but somebody definitely, yeah, could be healing. But it's something about, yeah, some, uh, oh, Wow. Yeah, so going back to, you know, lies and rumors, you know what I mean? Leading to somebody's clout. So, yeah, there were some false allegations, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like that, yeah, it's going to be revealed. Mm hmm. There's also some real allegations that are going to be revealed. There definitely are a lot of um, celebrities that are being targeted out here. There's also celebrities that are doing that are targeting. So it goes back to, yeah, you know, like uh, they're shooting arrows, you know what I'm saying, with, with venom on the end and it's and it's boomeranging. You know what I mean? There definitely are celebrities, you know what I'm saying, that definitely, yeah, could be, you know, like um, like all up in, you know, the uh, collectives in, in, in tarot land, you know what I'm saying, on YouTube or TikTok or whatever, you know what I mean? I feel like, yeah, there are people, you know what I'm saying, that have, like, spiritual platforms. Yeah, there are celebrities that are lurking, you know what I mean? But these are celebrities that, yeah, they've been targeting people. So it goes back to, yeah, targeting people, you know what I mean, to get their channels taken down and woo woo yada yada. But, yeah, the game is over. So, yeah. Whether these people are celebrities or people in high places or, you know what I'm saying, people in low places, I feel like the game is over. Uh, somebody or somebody or some people were, yeah, they were violated. Mm -hmm. Somebody didn't know, you know what I'm saying, that somebody, yeah, knew. But I feel like it, but somebody was stupid and stupid to think that somebody didn't know what was going on. You know what I mean? This could all, this could go from, yeah, somebody being violated to, you know, spreading the rumors and the lies or whatever the situation is. Somebody's stupid. Somebody knows that somebody has spiritual gifts, you know. Maybe somebody thought that, yeah, they had stopped somebody from using their spiritual gifts or something like that. There's people that are being stopped in their tracks, point blank in the senses, ends, and period. And I feel like it's because karma is getting heavier and heavier and heavier. Um, but, yeah, somebody's civil rights could have been violated, you know. Mm-hmm. But it's something about, yeah, siblings, because that's what's on this card. There is a lot of anger towards somebody. Mm-hmm. It definitely could be because, yeah, people are going to prison, because that's what's on this card, prison or rehabilitation. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, somebody somebody's done decoded the matrix. But it's with their God given gifts. So if somebody, yeah, not really decoded the matrix, but yeah, basically, yeah, has figured a lot of people out. You know what I mean? And they've used their God given gifts to do it, you know? Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah, there's somebody or some people that, yeah, are trying to hack into somebody's spiritual gifts or trying to hack into somebody's energy. So I feel like the, yeah, uh, somebody definitely, yeah, just needs to be aware. Um, but there is somebody that, yeah, could be realizing that the grass ain't greener on the other side. So it goes back to, yeah, pretty pink, baby blue. Why don't you teach me something new? Mm-hmm. So, yeah, somebody possibly, yeah, wants a new life. Somebody definitely, yeah, could be evolving. This is also, too, yeah, new flame. A grown-ass man. Mm-hmm. There definitely, yeah, could be somebody that, yeah, could have been, could have operated in their south node for a very long time. You know what I mean? That basically realized that, yeah, the grass ain't greener. You know what I mean? In the south node, let me go to north node and see what it do. You know what I mean? They definitely, yeah, could be growing up, could be evolving. Whoever this person is, they could like to dance. But they basically are realizing that, yeah, these hoes ain't loyal. So this could be, you know, the person that could be, you know, revealing, you know, something about the false marriage or yeah, they could, this is, they could find out that yeah, their marriage is false because we got Beyonce out here. We know Beyonce is a married, um, no offense to Beyonce. That's just the cards. Um, so yeah, this is also too. Yeah. Like cheating, cheating allegations as well. Mm-hmm. Somebody, yeah, definitely could be tapping into, you know what I'm saying, like their spiritual gifts. And they could find out, you know what I'm saying, that, yeah, um, they have like a rare spiritual gift, you know. Somebody, yeah, could find out, yeah, that they're, you know what I'm saying, a part of, you know, like royalty. Because it's royalty on this card. Mm-hmm. Wow. We got the Godfather at the bottom of the deck. So, yeah, something about payback. Somebody could come from a crime family. Yeah, organization. So, yeah, some type of organization definitely is being taken down or something like that. We got wedding on here. Mm -hmm. Somebody definitely, yeah, has political connections. Uh, but on the card, it says an offer he can't refuse. So, somebody, yeah, definitely could have, you know, taken some type of offer that they thought that they couldn't refuse. So that could be, you know, why, yeah, why somebody, you know what I'm saying, is looking like, you know what I'm saying, uh, yeah, Chuck, stuck Chuck. This is also, too, yeah, like somebody, you know, paying somebody, you know what I'm saying, to marry somebody, paying somebody to get somebody pregnant, you know what I mean? So it goes back to, yeah, uh, a false marriage. But there's also, yeah, somebody that could be, you know, no longer um, living, you know, a certain type of lifestyle as well with that Godfather energy. Mm hmm So it's kind of like, yeah, some type of case could be closed, you know? And so, you know, somebody's like, yeah, now that now that that's done and over with, it, it's time, you know what I'm saying, to, to just, you know what I'm saying, uh, yeah, turn a new leaf, you know what I mean? Turn a new page in the book, going back to, you know, the energy from yesterday. And so, yeah, that could be what somebody's doing, you know what I mean? Growing up, you know what I mean? Wanting to, you know what I'm saying, learn something new, something different, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, evolve, you know? So somebody definitely, yeah, could be spiritually awakening out here. But there are a lot of people that definitely, yeah, could be pulling on somebody's energy. But I feel like that these people are about to be stopped in their tracks. Mm -hmm. Whoever this person is, they definitely, yeah, could be realizing, you know what I'm saying, that a lot of those people around them weren't, you know what I'm saying, yeah, loyal. They weren't, you know what I'm saying, their friend, you know what I mean, they weren't family members or whatever. Yeah, somebody's a basket case out here as well. Mm-hmm. There definitely, yeah, could have been a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? There could be that, yeah, a part of a rumor, you know what I mean, was that somebody was a basket case. You know? It's kind of like, yeah, somebody or some people's rumors could lead to, you know, like somebody having, you know, um, like going viral. Or, you know, this could be, you know, like somebody, yeah, people telling somebody that they're, that uh, somebody's a basket case. And so somebody, yeah, could, uh, could you know, receive like a, a movie role. You know what I mean? Um, and, and yeah, do a great job, you know, but somebody's really not a basket case, you know? Mm-hmm. 
Wow. Something about, yeah, uh, some kids or some teenagers. So something to have to do, yeah, with an organization, a cult. This is also, too, yeah, like, um, yeah, somebody paying, you know what I mean? Paying, paid marriage, paid pregnancy. I don't know, paying people. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but it came right back out, the Matrix. Mm hmm So, yeah, there are people that are stuck. Mm hmm People, yeah, they're, they're plugged in, you know what I'm saying? They, they choose to be plugged in, but somebody else, yeah, chooses to be unplugged, you know what I mean? Somebody, yeah, def somebody, or some people, yeah, they're, they, yeah, could be, yeah, like losing their minds, or you know what I'm saying? Because, yeah, somebody has figured figured some some stuff out. Mm hmm But but it's because of yeah, somebody's God giving gifts. It's because, yeah, y'all see on, on his forehead it's the truth. Yeah, somebody is being given the truth, but it's it's yeah, from from the spirit realm, you know what I mean? From the most high, from you know what I mean? Uh yeah. Their their spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors. It says the chosen. So somebody yeah could be a part of the chosen, you know what I mean? Somebody definitely, yeah, could be finding out that they possibly, yeah, are a part of the Chosen. So it goes back to, yeah, two people, you know what I'm saying, coming together, you know what I mean? This could be two people coming together, you know what I'm saying, to, yeah, take on the world, you know, like Peaky and the Brain, you know? Um, but, yeah, there are definitely, yeah, there are people that were working for somebody because it's agents on this card. Mm-hmm. Wow. 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 I'm also picking up too, yeah, somebody's father, somebody's godfather or something like that. Definitely, yeah, could have, you know, um, paid, you know what I'm saying, for some type of target or paid, you know what I mean, for, you know, yeah, somebody to, you know, this is, but, but given it's the godfather energy, it's like, yeah, somebody that has political connections or somebody, yeah, that's, you know, uh, in a high place or, you know, is, is respected by many people. You know what I mean? It's something about, yeah, that person calling some type of shots. Mm-hmm. This could also be, too, you know, like uh, somebody that had pa passed away as well. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, if that's, you know, if that uh, resonates with somebody, then, yeah, somebody's somebody's godfather or father, you know what I mean, that, yeah. Is, is, is high ranking, yeah, definitely could be calling shots. So, you know, this could be somebody that, yeah, could be calling shots, you know, when it comes to, like, other people's, you know, uh, spiritual team, you know? Mm-hmm. But somebody definitely, yeah, could be moving on. Wow. So, moving on could be, you know, like, um... Yeah, like somebody moving, you know, somebody, you know, ending something, you know, and moving on. But this is also, too, yeah, kind of like, yeah, people, you know, being stopped in their tracks, you know what I mean? And they can't do nothing but move on, you know what I'm saying? They can't do nothing but, yeah, accept defeat, you know? We got a thief, so somebody's a thief out here. Mm-hmm. 24, which breaks down to a 6, so it's giving me Gemini energy. Somebody could be, yeah, Gemini, Cancer, Cusper. Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah. There, there's a thief that could pass away. Somebody yeah, is a destiny thief as well. Mm-hmm. I feel like I feel like yeah, somebody had a lot of stamina, you know what I'm saying? Or some people, you know what I mean? They yeah, like the energizer bunny, but I feel like yeah, it's the energizer bunny, but without the energizer battery, you know what I mean? So somebody yeah had an off brand battery thinking that they're the energizer bunny. It's yeah. I feel like somebody mm mm mm, mm. And the the fact of the matter is, yeah. 
the real reason why somebody could pass away is because of yeah some type of ritual but this is also too yeah like somebody protecting themselves uh somebody yeah the angel number two four 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 could be significant you could be seeing two I mean, you could be seeing the angel number 444 a lot. So, yeah, somebody definitely is is protected. You know what I mean? This could be, too, like, physical. You know what I'm saying? Like, somebody, yeah, trying to steal from somebody. Somebody physically, yeah, somebody's protected. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 244, you know? So, somebody, yeah, somebody's amongst the 244, you know what I mean? But we know it to be uh, 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 144,000, not 244,000. So somebody, yeah, has got it confused. I feel like, yeah, there's a there's somebody out here that thinks that they know everything, but they don't know shit is what I feel like. But, yeah, game over. Somebody is protected, you know what I mean? Somebody definitely, yeah, could be angry because somebody's protected, you know? There's also somebody that, yeah, could be behind bars, you know what I'm saying, that, yeah, could be, you know, doing some stuff, you know? This is, yeah, there, so, yeah, somebody could be behind bars, you know what I'm saying, calling shots. Or this could be, yeah, like behind, you know, the, the, the screen, you know what I'm saying, like the, the, the phone screen, the laptop screen, the, the iPad screen calling shots. This could be, you know, somebody, um, this could be somebody, you know, behind, um, you know, uh, yeah, behind other people trying to call shots. Mm-mm. Wow. This is also too, yeah, like if somebody did, you know, do some type of ritual, you know what I mean? Uh, this could be, you know, like, yeah, somebody, you know, um, surviving, you know what I'm saying, the ritual or something like that. This is also too, yeah, giving me like, yeah, somebody, you know, like celebrity status, you know what I mean? Or somebody that, yeah, around celebrities, you know, could like tell their story of how they survive, you know, rituals and sacrifices and things of that nature, because that's what I'm picking up as well. Mm-hmm. I feel like, yeah, somebody, somebody has survived some stuff, and they're about to, yeah, be able to tell their story, but it's also, too, yeah, like, um, you know, rumors and lies and stuff that were told on somebody, it's about to, yeah, be, it, it basically, it, it's turning into a blessing. Yeah, somebody's about to become a rising star, or somebody already is a rising star. Somebody could be born in 1977, mm-hmm, but this is, yeah, two, two spiritual beings, the number 77, so there could be two people that have the life path number seven that could be, yeah, coming together, you know what I mean? This is spiritual connection, mm-hmm. There definitely, yeah, could be somebody that could be trying to steal, you know what I'm saying, a spiritual connection. Or it goes back to, yeah, trying to steal somebody's destiny. Mm-hmm. And then we got commitment at the bottom of the deck. Mm-hmm. This is also, too, yeah, somebody, you know, meeting somebody that they don't know. But it's kind of like, yeah, it's going to feel like the, yeah, two people have known each other for forever, you know? So it goes back to, yeah, mirroring. So this could be, you know, when I said mirroring, but not in a good way, this could be, yeah, two people, you know what I mean, that basically, yeah, were being targeted, you know, in multiple ways, you know, that could be coming together, you know what I'm saying, and making, yeah, a powerful couple, you know what I mean, whether it be, you know, a powerful business uh, partnership, a powerful friendship, you know, a powerful, you know, commitment, a powerful marriage. Mm-hmm. This is also, too, yeah, somebody finding out that somebody, yeah, has been, you know, married three times or, you know what I mean, has put somebody or some people, you know what I'm saying, in false marriages, you know, three times, you know? Mm -mm. Yep, but then we have karma. So, yeah, a part of somebody or some people's karma is to watch two people come together, you know? I feel like for somebody, yeah, it's going to be, you know, somebody that, you know, that they wouldn't, you know, expect to come together with and other people wouldn't as well. Mm-hmm. But there's also, yeah, somebody or some people that could be concerned, you know, and I feel like, yeah, somebody could be losing sleep, but it's, but it's about the karma, you know. This is also, yeah, people losing sleep because, yeah, somebody's done figured them out. Wow. 
wow. Somebody, yeah, somebody's, a, yeah, stacks on stacks on stacks. Somebody's about to receive, yeah, some money. This is also too, yeah. Somebody did some unloyal stuff for money. Mm-hmm. With these hoes ain't loyal, with this actual money, so yeah. But it goes back to, yeah, the rumors and the lies. So yeah, people could have lied and said that somebody, yeah, done strange things for change, you know. That's how, you know, they became this rising star that they are, you know. People could have said that, yeah, somebody was stealing, you know, to become the rising star that they are. I feel like, yeah, people said multiple things, but I'm also picking up too that, yeah, People are going to find out that, uh, yeah, the real truth of somebody, you know what I mean? And it is that somebody's a thief. Somebody, yeah, has done strange things for change, you know? Mm-hmm. 77, 11. It's a lot of Ascendant Master numbers out here because I saw Ascendant Master number 33. So, yeah, somebody definitely, yeah, uh, is, is surrounded by their Ascendant Masters. Somebody, yeah, could be seeing the angel number, uh... 711 a lot somebody could be 46 years old or somebody could be born in 1964 mm -hmm. somebody could be seeing the angel number 411 a lot 611 mm -hmm. so yeah ascended master but the 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 one one is giving me like yeah twin flame mm -hmm. yeah There is somebody that, yeah, didn't waver when it comes to, you know, their faith. Didn't waver when it comes to their belief, you know? That's why, you know, somebody, you know, is the rising star that they are. That's why somebody, you know, is in this energy. That's why somebody is about to, yeah, receive stacks on stacks on stacks. But I really feel like uh, when it comes to, like, the stacks on stacks on stacks, it has something to do with somebody being violated, you know? Mm-hmm. There's also, yeah, somebody, some people that are angry because they feel like, the yeah, somebody's disloyal. You know what I mean? It's kind of like, yeah, people sold their soul, you know what I'm saying, to the devil is what I'm feeling like. But, yeah, somebody basically, yeah, gave their life over, you know what I'm saying, to, to the most high, you know. And so, yeah, somebody could be, you know, using their spiritual gifts in the way that they're supposed to. And they possibly, yeah, could be getting money, you know what I mean, for it, you know. There are people that are mad. There are people that, yeah, sold their soul, you know what I'm saying, and mad because, you know, they, yeah, they're losing, you know what I mean? These are the same people that, yeah, could have targeted somebody or whatever. They're mad. They want somebody to believe that, yeah, they shouldn't, they shouldn't reap, you know, financial benefits, you know, from using their spiritual gifts. But that, that ain't what God said. If God didn't want somebody to receive, you know, financial benefits for using their spiritual gifts, they wouldn't receive financial benefits, you know? Mm-hmm. Wow. But I feel like, yeah, through throughout everything, somebody, yeah, they never wavered when it comes to their faith. And I feel like, the yeah, um, that's why, yeah, this faith card is a 46, which breaks down to a 10. So, yeah, somebody's about to have some type of new beginning. Case closed. You know what I mean? Yeah, somebody's about to take off, you know? And this definitely has something to do with, yeah, somebody, you know, basically, yeah, decoding, you know what I'm saying? Uh, decoding some stuff, you know what I mean? Decoding the system, decoding, you know what I mean? This could be, yeah, like... Uh, you know, like agendas, you know what I'm saying? Like the dark, dark agendas, you know? Mm-hmm. Somebody definitely, yeah, could be under some type of spell or something like that. Somebody could be uh, 58 years old. Somebody could be, you know, uh, born in 1985 or this is, yeah, like somebody, you know, going back to, yeah, the, the Matrix. People choosing the red or the blue pill, you know? Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah, somebody could be a star seed. So, yeah, if somebody's a star seed, uh, yeah, if somebody has a child or children, yeah, they would be, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, star seeds. We got an ice king out here. Somebody could be 42 years old. Yeah, the number 24 is very significant. Yeah, either way it goes. 24, 42 is the same thing. 2 and 4 breaks down to a 6. 2 and 4 breaks it down to a 6. Somebody could be born in 1966. Somebody could be traveling Route 66. Yeah, going nowhere quickly is what I feel like. Mm-hmm. 
But it's also too, yeah, like endless. So yeah, somebody could have endless possibilities. Mm-hmm. But somebody is, yeah, cold. Somebody, yeah, definitely could be manifesting somebody from their past. So I feel like that somebody definitely, yeah, needs to be aware of that as well. Mm -hmm. We got rich girl at the bottom of the deck. So somebody, yeah, definitely could be a rich girl or definitely getting ready to become a rich girl. But this is also too, you know, uh, like, yeah, somebody that ha already has, you know, a lot. Yeah, being greedy. You know, so yeah, what is that? Uh, that's one of the seven deadly sins, you know, greed. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Yeah, December the 24th could be very significant. December the 11th could be very significant. Yeah, somebody, somebody's about to have some real love for sure. Somebody definitely, yeah, could be single. They could be sexy and they could be successful. Wow. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there definitely could be somebody that, yeah, has bad memories, but we were picking up that energy. And so I feel like, the, yeah, that could be somebody that, uh, yeah, could be, you know, scared to have a conversation. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Trying to avoid having some type of conversation. This could be a toxic feminine. You know what I mean? That somebody could, uh, that could be having bad memories. Or there is somebody that's having bad memories about a toxic feminine energy. Mm-hmm. Yep. Whatever, whatever. Yeah, somebody's first, middle, or last name could start with a P. Uh, but whatever, yeah, somebody or some people were doing, yeah, they were starving for attention. Mm hmm. So, yeah, doing anything for clout energy. So, yeah, somebody, you know, or some people in that doing in that do anything for clout energy. Yeah, um, they, they are about to, yeah, cause somebody to have, you know, what I'm saying some clout. You know what I mean? Mm hmm. Wow. Here goes that uh, plan to physically attack somebody. So, yeah, it goes back to, yeah, somebody calling shots. So I'm picking up, yeah, like with that godfather energy. Yeah, somebody's godfather or somebody's father, you know. So I feel like, yeah, there could be one person, you know what I mean, that could have, yeah, like messed a whole lot of people up, you know. Mm-hmm. But it's something about, yeah, some type of case being closed, you know. If there was, you know, like some type of false accusation, you know, somebody like could have lied and told, you know, people that somebody planned to physically attack them, but they didn't. Yeah, case closed. Mm hmm. But it's because, yeah, the truth is out or it's because, you know, what I'm saying, uh, yeah, like um, somebody has figured some stuff out. And people, yeah, could be trying to figure out, yeah, how somebody, you know, knows, you know, what I'm saying everything that they know, you know. This is also too, yeah, people, yeah, figuring it out. Yeah, somebody really does have, you know, God giving gifts, you know. Mm hmm. Wow, and we have funeral. So, yeah, there could be some type of funeral, you know what I mean, that could take place. Uh, I feel like, yeah, somebody needs to be aware because there definitely could be some type of plan to physically attack somebody at the funeral. So it goes back to, you know, um, somebody uh, being uh, invited somewhere. So somebody, yeah, could be, you know, invited or being told that, yeah, there's a funeral, you know, that's going to take place. You know what I mean? And, uh, yeah, for somebody, yeah. The invitation could be, yeah, to get somebody somewhere to, to physically attack somebody. Mm hmm But this is also, too, yeah, like karma getting ready to be handed to somebody or some people, you know what I'm saying, on a silver platter, you know? And, yeah, it could be in the form of a funeral, you know, for, for somebody or multiple people, you know? Yep, we got Target. Mm hmm Yep. The fact of the matter is, yeah, um, there is, yeah, like the, the one that was targeting is now, yeah, being targeted. This could be like a toxic feminine energy. And they, yeah, could have been using other people, you know what I mean? Like their father or their godfather that, you know what I'm saying, have ties or, you know what I'm saying, part of some type of organization. Yeah, well, it's in the reverse. And so with that being said, as far as the big house being in the reverse, and so, yeah, somebody could be, be could, yeah, either somebody was the target or somebody still is. Either way it goes, it don't matter, you know what I mean? 
it's kind of like, yeah, people didn't learn no lessons already. So it's something about, yeah, the mal karma wasn't good enough. You know what I mean? So, yeah, karma is being amped up. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There's also somebody or some people that could be finding out this information. So this could be, yeah, because we, because this thief card is a 24, which breaks down to a 6. So the past. And then we have um, the Ice King, which is a 42, which breaks down to a 6. The past. So, yeah, there could be people that could be finding out, you know what I'm saying? Some Finding some stuff out now about, you know, something that took place in the past. The past could have been, you know, yesterday, last week, last month, last year. Mm -hmm. We got reckless endangerment, so... Um, there is a toxic feminine that, yeah, it's a part of some type of reckless endangerment situation. But it goes back to, yeah, people spreading rumors and lies, you know what I'm saying, basically is, is yeah, going to be a blessing to somebody. Um, somebody, yeah, definitely could have been targeted, you know what I mean? Somebody, yeah, definitely could be being charged with reckless endangerment. It's also, too, something that happened in the past or something that maybe didn't happen in the past, you know, as, as to why some type of case has been closed, you know what I mean? Mhm. Mm yeah, there definitely could be people could be people that could that could be finding out that yeah, there were people that were trying to stop some type of case from being closed. Mhm. Mm and they were doing yeah, whatever they could do, you know what I mean, to make sure that the case wasn't closed, you know what I mean, or the case doesn't go, you know, in somebody's favor. Yeah, we got fraudulent DNA test. So yeah, somebody yeah, paid for a fraudulent DNA test. They definitely yeah, could have paid for, you know, marriage. They could yeah. They could have paid for a whole lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, there could be, you know, somebody that could be being targeted because, yeah, people are being exposed. But it's kind of like, yeah, the target is being targeted now. So, yeah, people, yeah, by somebody's ancestors. Mm hmm. So it goes back to, yeah, regardless of whether, you know, somebody is trying to steal from somebody spiritually or physically, yeah, it ain't going to go well for somebody or some people. That's what they've already done. And so, yeah, um, it's getting, karma is getting worse and worse for, you know, these people. Mm hmm And we did pick up on, yeah, um, December the 24th. So, yeah, I did say by December, yeah, karma is going to be at an all-time high. Um, so yeah, somebody definitely yeah needs to just stay prayed up. But this is also too, yeah, like um, you know, somebody being told to stay prayed up and basically yeah, they laughed, you know. It goes back to yeah, somebody thinks that they're untouchable, un unmovable, you know what I'm saying? Unstoppable. You know what I mean? So yeah, somebody is being touched, somebody's being moved, somebody's being stopped, yeah, in their tracks. Or this could be, yeah, like multiple people. Mm-hmm. There's also too, yeah, like uh people because on this breakfast club, yeah, it's kind of like, yeah, people that somebody, yeah, could have grown up with, you know what I mean, um, that could have passed away, yeah, could be protecting somebody. This is also, too, yeah, like people, you know what I'm saying, that 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 these people, you know what I'm saying, um, possibly grew up with or something like that, you know what I mean? People from, yeah, somebody's past that could have passed over, yeah, going back to, yeah, like somebody's ancestors are calling shots. So, yeah, their spiritual team members have to listen to somebody else's ancestors. Or the fact of the matter is, yeah, their spiritual team members, you know what I'm saying, are, yeah, just on somebody's side now. You know what I mean? Yeah, so somebody receives somebody else's spiritual gifts. Somebody receives, you know what I'm saying, somebody else's ancestors. Somebody's, you know what I'm saying, spiritual team team members. Mm -mm. Yeah, somebody's health is declining. So if there is somebody that was the, that was targeting somebody's health, yeah, their health is declining. This could be a masculine energy. This could be a toxic feminine. Mm -hmm. But there's also, yeah, somebody that has changed. So it goes back to, yeah, somebody, you know, growing up, somebody evolving. Mm -hmm. Wow. There's also, yeah, somebody that, that definitely, yeah, could be blindsided. You know what I mean? This could be by the truth. This could be by some information. This could be by, yeah, their health. Mm-hmm. Yep. There definitely is somebody or some people that, yeah, they have some type of hidden obsession with somebody. 
I feel like not really with somebody. They just have hidden obsession with targeting, you know what I'm saying, those that operate in their nerf node, those, you know what I'm saying, that have, you know, spiritual gifts, you know, those, yeah, it, it's it's kind of like, yeah, it's, it's a, a challenge, you know what I'm saying, it's challenging for these people, you know? Mm -hmm. Somebody's first letter, last name could start with a V. Somebody could be the vice president of something. VP, yeah, if we hit, get it. Yeah, somebody possibly, yeah, needs to get VPN or, yeah, somebody definitely, yeah, could be trying to hack into somebody's, um, you know, like uh, electronic devices or somebody's, um, uh, somebody's um, internet. Mm -hmm. But we got old news. So, yeah, something about the past. So somebody has a hidden obsession with, you know, the past or with, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, whatever took place in the past. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, somebody yeah to bring up, you know what I'm saying, uh, old news because they're starving for attention. You know, this could be starving for masculine energy's attention or starving, you know, for starving, you know, um, for feminine energy's attention. You know what I mean? Whoever this person is, yeah, they possibly need to go get treatment for addiction. Or they definitely, yeah, could be somebody who could be going to get treatment for addiction. This could be, you know, somebody that, yeah, could now be, you know, evolving or could be wanting to grow up. Mm -hmm. This is also, too, yeah, like going back to, yeah, somebody, you know, like um, putting their health to the side, you know. So, yeah, somebody definitely, yeah, could end up in the hospital. Mm-hmm. This is also too, yeah, like somebody being in the hospital and yeah, somebody um and somebody yeah asked for a DNA test. Mm hmm This could be, you know, like a baby. Or the fact of the matter is, yeah, be somebody starving for attention so bad, yeah, somebody's gonna end up in the hospital and somehow, some way, some type of DNA test is gonna be taken and yeah, it's gonna be fraudulent. Mm hmm So yeah. It's something about, yeah, somebody, somebody you know, trying to use some old news against somebody. And, yeah, some new news, you know what I'm saying, is being brought to the table. So, yeah, going back to, yeah, blindsided. Mm-hmm. It's also, too, yeah, somebody, um, yeah, this is the second love spell. Because um, the love spell card popped out. In the um, Kipperish deck. And then we have love spell again. So yeah, somebody definitely yeah could have done some type of love spell on somebody. Um, but. Uh, yeah, somebody definitely yeah could be blindsided. You know what I mean? About um, like a baby as well. But I feel like, yeah, this baby could be like multiple peoples. Mm-hmm. Somebody's hidden obsession when it comes to, you know, like something from the past, you know what I mean? I feel like that that is also, you know, um, like catching people up. It's something about, yeah, somebody, somebody, you know, spreading rumors and lies or somebody, yeah, bringing up old stuff, you know, uh, is causing new stuff, you know what I'm saying, to, 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 to appear, you know what I'm saying, like new information or something like that. Somebody's first mother last name could start with a G. Yeah, big G. So something about yeah, God. Mm-hmm. Wow. Somebody definitely, yeah, could be investing in positive change as well. Um, somebody definitely, yeah, could feel like that they're good all by themselves. Mm-hmm. Wow, for somebody, yeah. There definitely could be, yeah, somebody that, you know, uh, could be, you know, getting into some type of commitment. But there could be somebody that, yeah, could definitely just, you know what I'm saying, uh, their spiritual team could see fit for them to be, you know, continue to be by themselves, you know. There's also somebody that, yeah, could have, you know what I'm saying, basically, you know, made some type of choice or decision, yeah, to, like, be good all by themselves, which means, you know what I mean, like, only those, you know what I'm saying, that serve their highest good is to be in their energy and woo woo yada yada. And so, yeah, somebody could be holding, you know what I'm saying, a grudge against somebody because, yeah, somebody somebody chooses to be good all by themselves. Somebody chooses to invest in, uh, you know, positive change. We 
we got a Capricorn Aquarius cusper. So uh, there's a Capricorn Aquarius cusper that's involved. Um, there could be a Capricorn Aquarius cusper, yeah, that could be in the hospital or wind up in the hospital. The the funeral could have something to do with a Capricorn Aquarius cusper. And so, yeah, December the 24th, I do think that that is, yeah, the split. Where, yeah, Capricorn Aquarius cusper, you know what I'm saying, that, that energy. Somebody's ancestors are on a Capricorn Aquarius Cusper's head. This could be, you know, somebody that, yeah, was 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 a part of some type of target or some type of plan to physically attack somebody. Mm -hmm. This is also somebody that, yeah, could have been hiding a pregnancy. Mm -mm. Wow. Wow, we got an Aquarius. So there's an Aquarius. There's an Aquarius that could have some type of hidden obsession. Or yeah, uh, there's an Aquarius that's the target. You know what I mean? There could be an Aquarius that could be having bad memories. Um, mm -hmm. There could also be, yeah, uh, Toxic Feminine that's an Aquarius. There's multiple people, yeah, that could be scared shitless. Mm-hmm. Because, yeah, it's kind of like, yeah, people could be trying to figure out, you know, or they or they have figured out why somebody knows, you know what I'm saying? They they, they possibly, yeah, have been, been trying to figure out for a long time, you know what I'm saying, how somebody knows, excuse me, some information, excuse me, but now they know, you know what I mean? It's, it's because of somebody's God-given gifts. Mm -hmm. Somebody's emotional manipulator out here. It could be an Aquarius, or it could be a Capricorn Aquarius cusper. It could be a toxic feminine, toxic masculine. Um, but somebody's an emotional manipulator out here. So somebody likes to yeah manipulate with some with with uh and manipulate people with their emotions, but they could be scared because yeah they can't manipulate somebody with their emotions anymore. Mm hmm. Yep. This is somebody that, yeah, possibly can't reach somebody. So this is somebody that, yeah, definitely could be trying to get in contact with somebody. This is also, too, yeah, like somebody can't reach somebody. Like, yeah, somebody, you know, is 50 steps ahead of somebody. Somebody's first, middle, last name could start with a, a K. Mm-hmm. Yeah, whoever this is, whoever this emotional manipulator is, they're crooked. Or the, yeah, there's multiple crooked people, you know what I'm saying, that are, you know what I'm saying, involved. There's a Capricorn Aquarius Cusper that is crooked, you know what I'm saying? There's also, yeah, if somebody definitely, yeah, could have paid, you know what I'm saying, for some type of case to be closed. And so with that being said, yeah, it definitely could be being found out that, yeah, there was some crooked stuff, you know what I'm saying, that took place. There's also some crooked stuff that could have taken place uh, when it comes to some type of funeral. Mm -hmm. But there is some type of faded event that definitely is about to take place for sure. But that is the, the, the energy that I uh, picked up in that message as far as, you know what I'm saying, uh, in, the, in the next 30 days, uh, some faded events or some, uh, I don't know what I said, but something about, yeah, events. So, yeah, there could be one of those faded events that could be uh, taking place. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Somebody somebody could be traumatized. But this but this could be, you know, because of, you know what I mean? Uh some stuff that um yeah, they got themselves involved in, you know? This could be, you know, from karma, you know what I mean? This could be, you know, going back to yeah, the love spell, the ritual. Uh, you know, we saw the confusion and illusion card from the Kipper's deck. So yeah. Mm-hmm. It could be whoever this toxic feminine energy is, it could be multiple people. Mm-hmm. Wow, we got 911, so you could be seeing the angel number 911. Mm -hmm. Wow. So, yeah, something definitely could happen to where, yeah, somebody or some people have to call 911. Mm -hmm. This is also, too, yeah, like, um, uh, yeah, like karma hitting somebody, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I did say that, yeah, karma is going to be at an all-time high by the end of December. So, yeah, um, somebody, yeah, could, karma could be hitting somebody so bad that, yeah, uh, somebody could call 911 because, yeah, somebody could be acting irrational. Mm-hmm. 
This is also too, yeah, like emotional manipulator, you know what I'm saying? Trying to do something crooked, you know what I'm saying? To get out of something, you know what I mean? And so, yeah, they're going to, yeah, put on a show. Mm-hmm. Yep, but it definitely could be because, yeah, somebody done got tied up in somebody else's drama. Somebody, yeah, could have, so, the, yeah, it, this definitely could have something to do with somebody passing away. But this also, too, is, yeah, there's a crooked individual out here that got tied up in somebody else's drama that, yeah, could pass away. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. Somebody's first middle last name could start with a T. Somebody could be a private. So somebody could be in the military. PVT. Mm -hmm. Somebody, something definitely, yeah, could be um, on broadcasted on TV. So, yeah, there is some type of faded event that could take place when it comes to a bully. Mm -hmm. So it goes back to, yeah, that targeting energy. Yeah. Yep. And then we got the villain and the bad guy. So bully, uh, villain, bad guy, they're all the same. And we got a soulless being. Mm-hmm. Wow. So yeah, there definitely could be somebody that definitely, yeah, could be trying to duck. They somebody or some people definitely could be trying to duck somebody's ancestors. They definitely could be trying to duck karma. Mm-hmm. But yeah, you could be saying the angel number four four four. So yeah. Whoever you know, this message is resonating with. Just know that you are heavily protected out here in these streets. And I feel like, yeah, these people know now. You know what I mean? Uh, they were wondering, you know, how you knew some information. Now they know. Mm-hmm. And I feel like now they know, you know what I'm saying, why they're receiving karma. You know what I mean? Now they know, you know what I mean? But it's too late. The fact of the matter is, I feel like... Um, one one event, you know what I mean? Definitely, yeah, could uh, do it for, you know what I'm saying? Some people in this situation. So, yeah, like some one of somebody passing away, yeah, could cause other people, you know what I'm saying, to like want to bow down or, you know what I'm saying, want to, um, you know, like concede, you know, don't want no parts. Mm-hmm. There definitely, yeah, could be uh, somebody or some people that keep asking people about somebody, but nobody will tell them anything. Mm-hmm. We got an air sign male, so Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius, heavy Aquarius. So there could be an air sign male that keeps asking people about somebody, but nobody will tell them anything. This could also be too, like, yeah, people asking an air sign male about somebody and they won't uh, tell somebody or people anything. We got a payout headed your way. So there definitely could be some type of payout that could be headed somebody's way. Mm-hmm. Yep. There definitely, yeah, could be uh, somebody going through a family tragedy and they want to tell the truth. Somebody, yeah, could be being paid, you know what I'm saying, for somebody passing away. So people could find that out as well, you know. Mm -hmm. But somebody definitely, yeah, could be going through some type of family tragedy and they want to tell the truth because, yeah, they were bamboozled, they were treated, they were played, they were double-crossed. So it goes back to, yeah, somebody, you know, realizing that the grass ain't greener. That these hoes ain't loyal. Mm-hmm. Yep. Rock bottom is their new home. So that's, yeah, the energy that we was picking up at the beginning of the message. You know, as far as, yeah, like um, an organization, a cult, uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, yeah, a gang or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Going down, you know? Somebody, yeah, losing their home or having to downsize or, you know what I mean? Losing everything that they have, you know? Mm hmm We got a Libra. You could be a Libra, have Libra in your charter. There's a Libra involved. Yeah, this, we are uh, uh, in Libra season. So this could be, yeah, going on now. Mm-hmm. Yep. And there are and yeah. Uh legally, yeah, there has been a cord that has been cut. And so yeah, somebody committed some type of spiritual violation. Mm-hmm. And somebody blaming everybody except themselves is no longer working. Or people, you know, blaming everybody else is no longer working. So continue, yeah, to hold on to your truth. Mm-hmm. Because yeah. There is uh, somebody or some people, you know, that basically, yeah, they have been exposing info to get attention. Mm -hmm. But bad intentions equal bad attention. So, yeah, uh, the one that was targeting or the ones that were targeting are now being targeted. Mm -hmm. Yep. 
And there's also, yeah, somebody or some people that are using people around them for selfish reasons. So it goes back to, yeah, um, you know, somebody calling shots from, you know, behind the screen. Somebody, you know, I'm paying people, you know what I mean, to do their dirty work. This definitely could be a Libra. Mm -hmm. Or, yeah, air side male. Yeah, heavy Libra, heavy Aquarius, Gemini. There definitely is, yeah, somebody that has a high spiritual ranking, for sure. Um, this could be an air sign uh, male, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. I feel like the yeah, there's somebody, you know what I'm saying, that, that definitely could be fighting hard to get to somebody. So this could be, yeah, like somebody's twin flame or, you know, somebody's soulmate. Mm-hmm. But yes, whoever this is, that rock bottom is their new home. They're a scaredy cat. So yeah, they're ashamed to show themselves. Everybody is laughing at them. So it goes back to the message. Yeah, the energy that I picked up in that message when everybody was, when I, uh, the, when I kept hearing, ha, 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 ha. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this definitely could be a Libra. Libra keeps being at the bottom of the deck. Mm-hmm. Yep. This is somebody that, yeah, they were using others for a big ego boost. Using other people, you know, around them for their selfish reasons. And so, yeah, they're receiving karma. In any way, shape, form, or fashion, they're receiving karma. Mm-hmm. And so, yeah. Whoever this person is or these people, yeah, their bad intentions is leading to some type of bad attention. You know what I mean? But yeah, their bad intentions is also leading to somebody's good attention. Mm -hmm. They're in the limit now. And it's because of, yeah, their careless decision making. Mm -hmm. Yep. Self-control is about making conscious decisions, whether tough or inconvenient. So I feel like that, yeah, somebody's receiving good karma because of their self-control. So it goes back to, yeah, it's a celebration, bitches, with that calm card. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, somebody has remained in control. You know what I mean? Somebody has continued to make uh, conscious decisions. You know what I mean? Whether tough or, or inconvenient. And I feel like that, yeah, at the end of the day, um, that's why, you know good things are coming to somebody. I feel like that that's why good things have already, you know, uh, started to take place for somebody. But yeah, emotions are definitely running high. Mm-hmm. Yep. Whoever, you know, uh, Whoever is resonating with this message, you could be a peacemaker. Or there's a peacemaker out here that puts out fires before they escalate. Mm-hmm. There's also, yeah, somebody that possibly, yeah, now want, wants to be a peacemaker. Somebody could be a, a mutable sign, a Gemini, a Pisces, a Sagittarius, a Virgo. Or it could be multiple people that are uh, ashamed to show themselves. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow, we got a Capricorn, so yeah, heavy Capricorn energy that definitely, yeah, could have been using others for a big ego boost. Uh, that definitely, yeah, um, could be, ex uh, yeah, could have been exposing info to get attention. This is somebody that, yeah, they've been neglecting their health and they're about to be blindsided mm -hmm, with some information about their health. This could be, yeah, like somebody told, yeah, you only have 30 days to live, you know? Mm -hmm. This is also too, yeah, somebody that, yeah, was was uh, was doing, you know, indulging in the dark activities, you know what I mean? To try to come against somebody when it comes to like their health and their money. Mm -hmm. We got a mental illusion spell. So that's that energy, the illusion confusion. So yeah, somebody, yeah, is under the, basically the mental illusion spell that they basically projected onto somebody. So yeah, they could be, you know, having amnesia. Mm -hmm. So somebody else could could uh, be um, forgetting a lot of stuff, but I feel like the yeah they they not forgetting about their bad outweighing the good. That's the that's that's karma. You know what I mean? So yeah, somebody could forget their name. They could forget you know people around them, but they yeah it's replaying over and over and over in their head all the stuff that they've done to people. You know. Mm -hmm. 
Yep, we got an emotional roller coaster. So yeah, there is somebody or some people that are on an emotional roller coaster, especially an air sign male, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, heavy Libra, heavy Aquarius. Yep, somebody's hiding their feelings. They're afraid to open up. Or that's how they were, you know what I mean? And maybe they're no longer, you know what I'm saying, hiding their feelings. They're wanting to open up. But there is somebody that depends on others for their happiness. So it could be, you know, a Capricorn. So it goes back to, yeah, the Ice King. So, yeah, somebody is ice cold, you know what I'm saying, to somebody or some people. Yeah, but somebody, yeah, definitely, yeah, has is is, is has a high spiritual ranking. And there definitely is yeah, somebody that wants to open up to somebody. Whoever this person is, yeah, they possibly are folding under pressure. And they're folding under pressure because, yeah, they're in a dilemma. But it's because of their careless decision making. Mm -hmm. Wow. So, yeah. I feel like people, you know, were trying to figure out, you know, how you know or what you know. And now they know how you know or what you know. Mm -hmm. They figured it out, you know. But it, but I feel like, yeah, it's, 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 it's kind of become too late. Somebody, yeah, somebody could have gotten like a new home or something like that. And yeah, somebody could find out that, um, you know, their spouse had multiple people all up in their new house. You know what I'm saying? Doing the do, you know? But yeah, somebody, somebody, some people, they found other people's misery entertaining. And yeah, now they're the ones that's being laughed at. Mm-hmm. Somebody could be a Virgo, Libra, Cusper. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's too late. The ship has sailed. Mm -hmm. Somebody, yeah, somebody, somebody definitely, yeah, could be getting released from the hospital. Mm -hmm. There's also, yeah. Somebody that could be getting released from like jail or prison that, yeah, could be trying to marry somebody. Yep. And somebody, yeah, needs to basically know, you know what I'm saying, to not settle for less than they deserve. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, like, um... So, like, yeah, somebody's ancestors could have purposely caused the, a ship to sail. You know what I mean? So that somebody, yeah, wouldn't settle for less than they deserve. We got past connections. So, yeah. Uh, there definitely, yeah, could be somebody from somebody's past that could be trying to, you know what I'm saying, come back somebody's way. Um, yeah. But with the have no idea. And then we have the, the apple card, which is like the doctor, teacher, you know. Yeah. Somebody, it's something about, yeah, somebody not knowing somebody's health condition or something about yeah somebody's declining health somebody yeah definitely could try to hide that or or yeah somebody has already done that and now somebody wants to open up to somebody yeah we got not playing games at the bottom of the deck so somebody is not playing games anymore mm -hmm. or yeah the game is over Somebody or some people know that the game is over. So, yeah, there could be somebody that, yeah, they know that they can't, you know, play the game. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we have acquaintances, past past connections or past acquaintances that, yeah, um, yeah, that, that are thirsty for somebody's energy. So, it goes back to, yeah, somebody, um, you know, needing to protect their energy, you know. We got a cousin, so there's a cousin involved. There definitely could be a cousin that could be thirsty for somebody's energy. Somebody's cousin could go to the hospital. This is also, too, yeah, somebody's cousin being a part of, um, yeah, like, 
Um, you know, some type of dark work. Yeah, somebody definitely could find out that, yeah, somebody's cousin could have been a part of, yeah, trying to steal their destiny or something like that. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, we got sexual relationships. So, there definitely, yeah, could be people, you know what I'm saying, that somebody, yeah, could have had sexual relationships with that could be, yeah, thirsty for somebody's energy. It's a lot of people that are thirsty for somebody's energy, for sure. And I feel like somebody that definitely doesn't need to settle for less than they deserve. Mm-hmm. But there's a lot of people that, yeah, they entered in, into unfamiliar territory. So these are people, yeah, that basically have come across, you know, um, a star seed, you know, the, the, a chosen one. You know what I mean? Somebody, yeah, that's a part of the oracle, you know? Mm-hmm. But these are people that are living in the past. So these are people that, yeah, are in their south node. Mm-hmm. Yep. So yeah, people entered into unfamiliar territory, and yeah, they're they're going through some type of unexpected life changes, or they're, or they're about to. But there definitely could be yeah, somebody you know what I mean because of some type of unexpected life changes. Going back to yeah, somebody being blindsided. Yeah, they possibly yeah could be spiritually awakening, or you know what I'm saying they're possibly yeah evolving now. Mm-hmm. Wow, we got a temporary lover. So. uh yeah, there's even people, you know what I'm saying, from other people's past or people, you know what I'm saying, in other people's lives, you know what I mean, that could be thirsty, you know what I mean, for somebody's energy. It's kind of too like, yeah, like these people, whoever these people are, they were in somebody's life, you know, somebody gave them energy, you know what I mean, but they took that, they basically, yes, took the energy, you know what I'm saying, and gave it to somebody else, you know, and now that now that, yeah, people could have, you know, like severed ties with past people or temporary lovers. Yeah, they're looking for that energy, but it wasn't even that person's energy. You know what I mean? It was really, you know, whoever, you know, this message is for energy, if that makes any sense. Mm hmm. Yep. But there is somebody or some people that are only sorry they got caught. So there could be, yeah, multiple people who possibly are going to want to apologize but it's they're only sorry because yeah somebody done figured them out you know what i mean mm -hmm. yep somebody definitely yeah, is being protected from bad luck somebody's being protected from bad karma so it goes back to yeah somebody's ancestors purposely making the ship sa sail so that yeah somebody w won't settle for less than what they deserve mm -hmm. yeah we got september so yeah we are still technically in September. This is the last day of September. So, yeah, somebody or some people could have gotten caught in the month of September. Mm hmm. Yeah, there could be people that, yeah, could have entered into unfamiliar territory, you know what I'm saying, during the month of September. Somebody, yeah, definitely could get locked up. And so that would be unfamiliar territory, you know? Or somebody, yeah, could go to rehab and they, and that could be unfamiliar territory, you know? Mm-hmm. But yeah, we got clean slate. So somebody yeah could could receive some type of clean slate. So it goes back to yeah, like somebody being acquitted, uh somebody, you know, um somebody's case being overturned, or yeah, like some type of case being closed. Mm-hmm. Yep. There's also people that yeah, they think that yeah. There's some people that there 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 is a past connection that that thinks that somebody doesn't know who what's going on with them. You know what I'm saying? Because we have the don't know with that with the wisdom and knowledge card. So yeah. So there definitely yeah could be people who could or somebody, uh yeah that could come in thinking that yeah everything is good to go. You know what I'm saying? They don't know. You know what I'm saying? If I if they don't know, I ain't gonna tell them. But I feel like that yeah that person is getting karma as well. That's why that person is going through unexpected life changes. Mm hmm. People are trying to also, yeah, get money. So, yeah, rock bottom is people's new home, and they're trying to get money, and they're willing to do any and everything, you know what I'm saying, to get money, you know? But it's also, too, yeah, somebody is about to go through some type of good, unexpected life change, and, yeah, uh, they're about to acquire more money. Mm -hmm. People were being paid, you know what I'm saying, to do stuff, for sure. 
You could be seeing the angel number one, two, three, which I literally have been seeing that angel number a lot. It says there will be a change in your life where you will be able to move forward in a steady way. So, yeah. Yeah, somebody wants love, not war. Mm -hmm. This is also too, yeah, like somebody, you know what I'm saying, being positive and not negative. You know, somebody spreading positivity and not negativity, you know. Uh, but there is somebody that pretends to love and care only to get what they need and want. Yeah, they're fake. So going back to, yeah, somebody thinking that somebody doesn't know, you know what I mean? So this could be somebody, you know what I mean? That, yeah, they, they ain't looking at people around them. They ain't realizing that, yeah, these people, they already entered into some type of the unfamiliar territory. And, yeah, they're receiving some type of karma. Or it could be, yeah, these people, you know what I mean, are walking around like, yeah, they're like they're okay, but they're really not, you know? I feel like, yeah, somebody, you know, didn't take heed to the warning, you know what I'm saying? Didn't take heed to the caution tape or something like that. And, yeah, whoever this person is or these people are, yeah, they entered into unfamiliar territory. There's already people that, yeah, have already entered in and they, yeah, have found out, you know what I mean? What happens when you enter into, into that unfamiliar territory? Yep. These are the same people that, yeah, they're falling victim to their own negative projections. So it goes back to when I uh, when I picked up on, uh, you know, like them putting the venom on the end of the arrow. You know what I mean? And they shooting the arrow and then, yeah, boomerang and it comes right back. Mm -hmm. Wow. There's also, yeah, people that, yeah, walked away from somebody that are realizing that the grass wasn't green. And you know what I mean? So, yeah, there could be multiple people that, yeah, somebody could have went back to a past connection. Somebody, yeah, could have just, you know, been noncommittal, you know what I mean? And just, yeah, been involved, you know what I'm saying, with relationships just for, you know, sex. Uh, there could be, yeah, somebody that went to a temporary lover or so they thought it was, they thought it was, temp I mean, thought it was permanent, but it was really temporary. You know what I mean? Um, it's something about, yeah, or this could be, you know, like one person dealing with a lot of people goes back to, yeah, somebody, you know, finding out that, yeah, somebody Somebody got a new home and yeah, somebody's spouse had multiple people all up in the home. Mm hmm Yeah. We got lack of gratitude, so somebody, yeah, definitely, yeah, could have uh not shown gratitude to somebody. You know what I mean? Not shown gratitude, you know, to their ancestors, not shown gratitude, you know, uh to the most high, you know. Mm-hmm. But we got hospital records, so something about, yeah, the hospital. It's something, too, about, yeah, somebody making up some type of fraudulent DNA test. But the hospital records, you know what I'm saying, yeah, basically is the evidence. But it's also, too, yeah, like, um... Somebody, yeah, could have paid for some hospital records. So it goes back to, yeah, somebody's rights being violated. Mm -mm. Yep, but there is somebody or some people that, yeah, are, are definitely could be trying to emotionally drain somebody. Mm -hmm. There's a toxic feminine out here that, yeah, is emotionally draining. It could be a toxic masculine as well. Or, yeah, somebody could just be realizing that everybody around them are emotionally draining. Mm -hmm. But there is somebody that owes money to multiple people. So it goes back to, yeah, that Godfather energy. So whoever this is that owes money to multiple people, I feel like, the, yeah, somebody's going to act like that they love somebody or care about somebody, you know what I mean, only to acquire money. Or the fact of the matter is, yeah, that's what, you know, somebody or somebody has been doing. And, yeah, they're only sorry that they got caught. This is somebody that, yeah, they have some type of history of deceit and betrayal. Mm hmm. This is somebody that, yeah, could have some type of sudden outburst. And it could be because, yeah, they got caught. Uh, we got a Pisces, so there's a Pisces, you know, involved. Uh, yeah, somebody could uh, receive some hospital records when it comes to a Pisces, or yeah, somebody, because this Pisces energy is giving me like hidden. So somebody trying to hide some stuff, and they possibly, yeah, could have some type of sudden outburst because it comes out. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
there's somebody that yeah feels like a failure and this is yeah we have September you know what I mean and we are in Libra season so yeah this could be going on now mm -hmm. there definitely yeah could be a lot of people you know what I'm saying they secretly feel like a failure so yeah they secretly yeah are in their feelings you know what I'm saying uh, a lot of people are on emotional roller coaster yeah we got the summer so yeah somebody um Whatever somebody did in the summertime as far as owing people multiple, I mean, owing multiple people money, I feel like the yeah, people definitely, yeah, could be looking at somebody, you know what I mean? Because so, somebody could be a rising star. So, yeah, there could be people that could be thirsty for somebody's energy, thirsty for somebody's money, you know what I mean? So, when it comes to, you know, like people pulling on somebody's energy, that's what somebody really needs to be aware of, you know? Yep, we got an illegal business. So somebody, yeah, was trying to acquire money with, with some type of illegal business. Uh, be aware. Going back to, yeah, an offer he can't refuse. Somebody, yeah, took that offer and now they're stuck. Yeah, they're in a dilemma. Um, yeah, whoever this person is, yeah, they could be a wolf in sheep clothing. So it goes back to, yeah, somebody uh, owing a lot of people money. Um, this is somebody that, yeah, could come in, act like that they love somebody. You know what I'm saying? Want somebody, need somebody, but they, but they don't. They just, you know what I'm saying? They, they 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 need money they're trying to acquire money or something like that mm -hmm. this definitely could be somebody that yeah could be watching somebody in secret as well this could be yeah like a past connection but it's, it's something too about yeah the ship already has sailed so whoever these people are that you know what i'm saying that are watching somebody in secret or you know what i'm saying thirsty for somebody's energy so they're pulling on somebody's energy whether it be sexually whether it be you know what i'm saying uh you know trying to put a spell on somebody or whatever have you trying to you know drain somebody energetically or emotionally yeah they done entered into unfamiliar territory mm-hmm Wow. So, yeah, somebody definitely, yeah, needs to pay attention to any offers that are coming in, and that's for their protection. Mm hmm. Especially when it comes to, you know, like people from somebody's past. There definitely, yeah, could be somebody that could be being handcuffed or arrested, or, yeah, somebody needs to pay attention to any offers coming, you know, somebody's way. Because, yeah, somebody possibly, yeah, could be trying to set somebody up. Mm hmm. But there definitely, yeah, could be somebody that could um, be arrested, you know? But somebody knows that they broke somebody's trust. But it goes back to, yeah, they sold it and chose, so shall they reap it. Mm -hmm. Yep, somebody's too much in a good way. And I feel like the, yeah, um, there is somebody, you know what I'm saying, that, yeah, matches somebody, you know what I mean? So there is somebody else that's too much in a good way that somebody's about to, yeah, come across. You know, this could be, you know... Uh, when it comes to, you know, like um, a business relationship. But something about, yeah, this illegal business and paying attention to any offers, you know what I'm saying? Uh, it's out here for a reason, so somebody needs to be cautious. But yeah, um, yeah, there the game is over. The game is over. It's also too, yeah. Um, people know now that somebody's not playing games, but there goes that business relationship. So there could be somebody that could be watching in secret, you know what I mean? that uh could be you know trying to acquire money and this could be you know by yeah bringing some type of offer you know for somebody to get in some type of business relationship with them i feel like somebody definitely needs to be aware yeah the timing isn't right nope we got a taurus gemini cusper mm -hmm. this is also too yeah like people doing this to somebody so you know people you know what i'm saying Trying to get somebody wrapped up in drama or, you know what I mean? Trying to, yeah, get somebody involved in, you know, illegal businesses and things of that nature. You know what I mean? So it goes back to, yeah, people have already entered into unfamiliar territory. You know what I mean? And they're getting their karma. There's other people that haven't figured out about this unfamiliar territory that other people has already entered into. And there could be people that could be walking around like, you know, they're not getting karma. Their life is just so great. And so people are like, well, well yeah, let's go over there and play games with them. It's easy. You know what I mean? So, yeah, somebody could be being used as, you know what I'm saying, like some type of spiritual setup or something like that. But, yeah, there is there is some people that are looking over their shoulder for sure. Mm -hmm. There's also somebody that, yeah, doesn't want somebody to remember the past. 
Somebody could be 50 to 65 years old or something about, yeah, 50 to 65 years old, five year old. Yeah, we got a romantic relationship. So there is somebody that, yeah, they're not playing games. They do want a romantic relationship with somebody. But somebody doesn't need to settle for less than they deserve. And, and yeah, somebody has definitely entered into unfamiliar territory as far as, you know, like um, doing things to acquire money. You know what I mean? And possibly, yeah, uh, borrowing money or, you know what I'm saying? It's a reason why somebody owes money to multiple people. Mm-hmm. Wow. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Wow! So somebody yeah, is about to receive some, uh, about to receive a spiritual aid package, uh, but there is yeah um, a dark angel that definitely could be hovering over somebody. But that's the energy that I was picking up at the beginning of the message. Mm -hmm. There's a dark angel that's hovering over a lot of people. So yeah, somebody just needs to continue to stay in their lane and keep moving forward. Mm-hmm. Somebody's father, yeah, could be looking over their shoulder. So, yeah, God, father, father, energy. Mm hmm Or somebody, yeah, somebody's father could have passed away. Go, or Godfather, you know what I'm saying? Going back to, yeah, uh, somebody having a high spiritual ranking, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but there is somebody that doesn't want somebody to remember the past for sure. Um, this definitely got something to do with a romantic relationship. This is also too going back to yeah, somebody you know, um, you know, trying to do some type of mental illusion spell, you know, and it possibly was to cause amnesia. And now yeah, somebody has amnesia, but yeah, karma is justice. So yeah, even if you know what I'm saying, somebody didn't get locked up, you know what I mean. Even if you know it didn't even make it to you know like physical court. Yeah, I always say spiritual court. Is way, 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 way different than physical court. I would rather, you know what I'm saying, go to physical court and not spiritual court. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, a part of somebody's karma is a dark angel hovering over somebody to the point to where, yeah, they're not going to be able to fight it. We got a Scorpio Sagittarius Cusper mm -hmm. that's thirsty for somebody's energy. Wow. There is somebody that wants love, not war, because it keeps coming out. So there is somebody that wants love, not war. So it could be uh, this not playing games energy that, that keeps coming out. Mm -hmm. Somebody's father, somebody's godfather definitely could be a part of, yeah, some type of um, dirty money scheme or something like that. But there is the end of some type of cycle. So it goes back to, yeah... Um, something being taken down, you know what I mean? Um, something, uh, as far as, you know, like, um, somebody getting released, you know? It could be the end of, you know, like, somebody's jail sentence, you know what I mean? But somebody definitely does have some type of drug or alcohol addiction, or, yeah, somebody doesn't want somebody to remember that they have some type of drug or alcohol addiction. Somebody, or some people definitely, yeah, could be trying to get somebody to settle for less than they deserve. This is also too, yeah, you know, like somebody um, being made anew, you know what I mean? And so, yeah, um, somebody possibly doesn't want somebody to remember, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, the past version of somebody, which I feel like whoever this is, you know, if they're, you know, um, wanting to, you know, communicate with a divine being, you know, then they don't really know, you know what I'm saying? They're not there yet because they should know that, yeah, divine beings, you know what I mean? They're not there to judge, you know, they're, they're there to help you to continue to move forward in your life mm -hmm. so yeah there is somebody that definitely could be being watched and so yeah somebody wants to have some type of open and honest conversation with somebody mm -mm. yeah somebody definitely yeah could be hiring a lawyer and we got a divine feminine so you could be a divine feminine or there's a divine feminine um so yeah mm-hmm Somebody, yeah, could be being watched because they have health problems. So it goes back to, yeah, somebody, you know, not uh, taking care of their health or something like that. Or this is, yeah, 
uh, going back to the lies, you know what I'm saying? The rumors, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So, yeah, going back to somebody paying attention to any offers coming in for their protection, yeah, somebody definitely needs to pay attention. Somebody needs to look before they leap because, yeah, it's a trap. Mm-mm. It's also, too, yeah, like somebody, you know, realizing that, yeah, they should have looked before they leaped. Now they're stuck. This definitely got something to do with a, with a job or career opportunity. So it goes back to, yeah, the business relationship. But it's also, too, yeah, sometimes the domino effect has taken place. Boomerang effect has taken place, you know. And so whatever, you know, people have gotten themselves involved in, yeah, the justice system is also involved. Somebody definitely, yeah, could be suffering in silence or people could be suffering in silence. Mm -hmm. Somebody, yeah, definitely could be paying for tarot card readings as well. People are shook. Mm -hmm. I feel like, yeah, people were manipulated by a trickster in disguise for sure. People definitely did think that somebody was a trickster in disguise, but people, yeah, are finding out that, yeah, somebody's the real deal. But the fact of the matter is, yeah, people thought that somebody didn't know some stuff. Now they know that somebody knows some stuff. Mm hmm. But I feel like that, yeah, somebody just needs to be aware of those, you know what I'm saying, that are possibly, yeah, thirsty for their energy, trying to pull on their energy. You know what I mean? But I definitely do feel like that, yeah, somebody's going to receive some good news, you know? Somebody's definitely going to receive some type of update. This could be an update on somebody's health. Um, but the fact of the matter is, yeah, there is going to be some stuff that, that is going to be exposed. Um, and yeah. Karma is going to be at an all-time high for some people. You know what I mean? And I feel like the, it's already started, you know? Um, and so I feel like, the yeah, whatever the rumors are, you know what I mean? That people wanted to spread the fake news, the lies. Yeah, it's it's about to turn into a blessing for somebody. So as I always say, y'all, keep your head held high and your middle finger higher and everything's going to turn out in your favor. With that being said, y'all, that's been your message. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you soon.